Any questions? <laughs> oh, thank you. <laughs> Was it, um, by all accounts, Chernobyl was an incredibly emotional experience for all of you. How hard was it for you to, when it was done, to move on? Do you still think about that, the people of that time and what's going on under the earth of that quarantine area? The thing is, when you work with very dark material, you often have a lot of fun. You, you are not living the material, unless, except, of course, when you're in front of the camera. So it's not, I mean, when I leave the set, I turn off. So it was very easy. We had a lot of fun doing it. Everybody was working hard and treating the material very seriously. But that doesn't mean that you can't laugh and have fun. Next question. Thank you. Hi, I was wondering what it means for you to get this award uh, this morning in Korea. I don't know. I'm still in shock. So I really don't believe I can say. I, I, I will have to talk to my psychiatrist. But it really means. Anybody else? What is next for you? Next for me is a small film uh, in Europe with a young Chinese director that I can't talk about yet. Sorry. Congratulations. I watched the whole show and it was very devastating to watch. It was intense, but great performance. Thank you. How does your night look like now that you won the award, surprisingly, as you said? The, the night will probably take the same path as if I hadn't. I will do a couple of parties and then I will fall in, into bed. I came in last night, so I'm pretty tired. Thank you. Hi, yes, congratulations. You won tonight for a very serious role, but we also love watching you do comedy. If there was a reason for a Mamma Mia 3 to exist, would you do it? <laughs> I think I would. I mean, I don't even consider it working though, doing those films because we have so much fun together. So I would consider doing it. Thank you very much. Thank you.